Hey, how's it going? Welcome back. Decided instead of having a mirror image thing going here, put the towel over that and don't have to worry about it. <laughs> Shaved the head. Feels better. It's really hot outside lately and just wow. Yeah. Anyway, yes, from the from the thumbnail, the Lord Razor. There you are. That it is Lord Razor. Comes with one Lord blade. This is the, it says LP.1822L. So right there. But this is long life. This is known as the L6. So yeah, again, packaged toy, right? Anyway, this one does pop out of the back. And again, thanks mom. <laughs> I used to have this, but I, I think this was one of the ones that got accidentally pitched. So I wanted it back. And I will put this aside. I'm not gonna use this. I am going to use a fresh uh, Nasset, still in the thing, but uh, yeah, this is a three-piece razor made of aluminum. I think that the handle is. I don't know what the head is made out of, but there's what it looks like right there. Load, unscrew, and then the base plate, and then the top plate. I'll load that. Oh, I did. I set those there. Managed to find some single edge blades that go in a proper SE. Not these halved, but you know, like that go in a gem, because I do have that gem. I'm, I found them here in town. And apparently, they're really not that hard to find at all. They're sold as paint scrapers or scraper, window scrapers. And uh, this is Master Painter. It's $249 for 10 of them. And uh, I did check online and get that a lot cheaper. You can get those a lot cheaper than that, but that was right now. That's, I don't have to wait. No shipping or anything like that. So that's cool. And uh, before I whip up the lather, it's Arco. It's a, what do you call that, a coin? I cut a piece of the stick off. I call that a coin. I'm gonna use this again. I do have some stuff on the way. I did succumb to previous buying habits. Oh, I started it back. Hey, I'm back, I'm back. Oh no, I'm just gonna use this one razor, just a blade, just pick a blade. That's the one I like, I'm gonna use this one soap. Just keep it simple, right? Nope. Addicted to buying. <laughs> so get this brush wet. Shake it all the way out. I put probably a, yeah, a good teaspoon of water in that. I could show you. I've got a new phone holder it, and it, it wiggles. It's just hanging from a, anyway. Uh, anyway, I'll show you how much. See, plenty of water in there. Watch me not be able to get the phone back to where I want it again. There we are. So the brush is damp and that's it. All the water's in here. Technically, I mean, that looks like bloom water. So let's get this going. Right away. Wow, that's really good. It took all the water. Shaved my head with this earlier today and I used a Harry's for the last time. Uh, used it, it did okay. It was really tugging over here 
And I, I just, that's uh, not fun. But um, I have a eraser on the way that's supposed to be good for head shaves. So I'm getting the Royal Washcloth Hot. And my face hot. Ah, oh, that feels good. Ah, oh, heat on the face, man. Preps that beard. Oh, I'm, I'm growing a goatee, duh. I guess I could have left it there. That's all right. Huh. I'm not growing a mustache, though. So we'll do that. Arco works great. Some of you don't... Some of you don't like the smell. Smells like incense to me. Incense and lemon. Citronella. Okay. Lord Razor. Heating that up. I really didn't show it to you before, did I? Here it is. That looks like a 34C to me. Same head, kind of looking thing. Just really head heavy, but uh, I think I, mean, I think it might even be a little more mild than the 34C, but here, let's uh, let's go back to it here and see. Huh. Well, it had no problems with that, did it? That is, let's see, it's Saturday. The last time I shaved, was Wednesday. Staples, that was easy. Wow. Might have something to do with that blade, right? Oh, that's nice. Here's where you can tell, right, mustache. Matter of fact, I should start shaving there first and that'll tell me how the rest of the shave's gonna go. It's about one in the afternoon and I really should wait to shave. But I've been dying to use this. I've been dying to make a video. because I've been dying to interact with you in the comments section. Okay, great. Great for beginners, I would think. But still going to get the job done.
There we are. Do some trimming up here, shaping up. Okay. Here we go for pass two. I'm gonna get a rinse and then I'll reapply some leather and we'll do that. So really all I'm doing, I'm not even really rinsing, I'm just putting a little bit of water on my face. I'm not like totally doing it a couple of times or anything, just putting some on. And I did go back to hot water shades. Just was noticing some issues down in the chin area. Well, I'm not shaving my chin now, right? Probably could go back to the cold water, but it seems a little pasty to me, but you know, should be okay. Hot. Let's go cross screen. Go a little higher than that. There we are. I'm gonna go that way. Ever so gentle. It's getting skippy. Wet the tip of the brush down. Okay. This razor has way more bite than I remember it having. Maybe I didn't have the L6. Maybe I had a different one. Mmm, seems like it's biting at the same angle. It's not like this. It's not even like that. It's almost way out here before it really starts cutting whiskers. There we are. Well, this is a really good render, especially for being inexpensive. I would say this is a good beginner razor because there I just pushed. Like you would with a cartridge. And that's okay. You can do it. I wouldn't advise it, but you can do it. Yeah, way more bite than I remember.
never said you know. I don't ever remember getting that smooth with that razor. It's pretty good. All right, big rinse here. Hmm. Whatever we use for the, whatever I used, I didn't look. Hmm. So <laughs> Okay, I already have witch hazel on my head, but I'm gonna go ahead and put some on. This is the kind I have right now. I've used all kinds and they're all pretty good. And this was this one is unscented. It smells like, like a mesquite barbecue. <laughs> While that's drying, I'm gonna dry my hands. While that's drying, I'm gonna wash this brush out. Tell you my thoughts on that razor. Yeah, very impressed. I don't remember it being that good. Wow, I'm thoroughly uh, pleased with that. A very good, very good result. Very good, very good shave. Yeah, I wanted to handle something. Kind of like a, not a don't buy this product, but a buyer beware. And it's in the medicine cabinet here. This Omega. This one. The loft on this brush, just the loft. Here, I'll put it at the bottom of the screen so you can see. Look at that. The loft on it's ridiculous. Here, but over here it looked like it was elongated or something. I don't know. Anyway, it's too high. Handle aside, the loft is just too, it's too big. It becomes floppy. Then when I used it in the video, I took it to the bathtub like this. And I went to shake it out and the brush fell out of the handle and part of it cracked. And I'm like, what, what just happened? I'm still holding this part of the handle in my hand. The sticker comes off just so you know that and then you will be able to tell that it, it is branded on the bottom, but I thought that was not plastic. It's not metal. It's not a thin metal. It's plastic. So a little bit disappointed there and with the that shiny stuff coming off the plastic. And I haven't been rough on it, I've only used it once. So it's not that I've got anything against Omega. The new brush I've got on the way is an Omega. So it's not that. I just don't like that brush. Anyway, uh, head is shaved, face is shaved. Very smooth, very, yeah. You know this, genuine Ogallala Bayram Cologne. Shake well before using. I'm gonna put it on everything, the head, the face, put it in my eyes. Missed a little bit back there. No burn, well, I can feel a little bit of a burn there. I wonder if I should have shaken that again. That's all right. No initial burn up here now. And there's, there's a little bit of fragrance burn. There we go. It's the cinnamon, clove, I can feel that. 
Mmm. Oh, it smells so good. That's, oh, it's so good. Wow. So spicy. All right. Well, that was my review of the, I don't know if it's new and improved or what's going on or just, hey, put a Nash set in one of these and it's good. Maybe. There it is. Lord Razor. L6 or what was it? LP1822L. LP1822L. Very, very impressed with that. And uh, yeah. I'll probably just go ahead and use that in the next shave. Maybe. We'll see. All right. Well, Ogallala leaves you hydrated, so I'm done. Catch you guys in the next video. And, oh, comment section. Tell me your shave of the day. There we go. All right, well then, yeah, see you in the next video. Take care of yourself, stay safe, and do something fun. Bye now.